Well, I'm pretty certain this will be the, the design for the speaker baffle um, that I've been working on. You can see the illustrations down here is how I started. Um, simplistic and ineffective and then complicated and couldn't be made. And then finally, just what I needed, nothing more, nothing less, um, and shaped the exterior around the fit in the tender, the things I had to clear and the, um, the space that was allotted. Then I did the um, creation inside what they call the, the, I don't know what they call that thing. It's called a shell. I did the, the shell function after I had the exterior shape in place. I put in a few screw holes to think of a clamp of somehow I can screw that in. Not enough room up here, but I think two down here will do it. And um, I got a hole for the wiring to come out. I've rounded the top, so if the coal is above it, it, it would sort of form fit. I had to clear the two corners, so I had to make these pieces here. And, uh, and then the angle allows us to put the speaker inside um, without uh, the, um, the speaker components hitting anything. Uh, I think I can show that if I go here and then I go to a side view only maybe the other side is a little easier for us less congestion maybe not okay there we go so here you can see the speaker is in there's room down here there's room all the way back here room back here uh, and then the wiring would be somewhere along here and just thread out the hole and I'm hoping then this will fit in there nicely. If not, um, we may have to do some modifications here. Uh, empty, thin down the base, which I don't mind doing. It's one and a half, 1.5 millimeters now. Uh, so I could go to one, uh, easy enough, um, just for the base. The rest of it, I want it to be, you know, stiff enough that it can push the sound out when it's played. Um, I mean, it's a speaker, uh, sort of cabinet baffle whatnot but it's certainly as big as this the size that would have come with the speaker it's it's nearly as big it's not as deep but it I've given it all the space I could on the uh, all the surrounding sides it's more of the area that's available than it is the shape so I'm hoping this will give us the sounds we're looking for and not create a problem um, it's one of the more complicated speaker boxes, but I'm thinking we're going to use this shape of tender and we're going to need a speaker. So I went ahead and put the day and a half, two days into this um, so that we'll have a speaker I can then use in this tender. Even if I elongate it and change the sides and make it a different shape, turn it into a royal blue, it won't matter. Um, the, the speaker will fit exactly. So that felt good. So I'll get this printed up, test fit it, and move on. That's what I'm doing today. Snow, it's not a snow day, it's after snow day, but we're so worn out, shoveling the walk and all that, putting down the salt and the sand. Um, we have more snow coming Friday. I know a lot of people have a lot worse, so I am not complaining. I'm doing fine. I'm glad I started my workouts earlier in the year because uh, that saved me. Okay. Um, that's it for now. Later.